hello guys welcome to a very easy how to do it yourself video basically in this video I'll be showing you step by step how to take a candle like this an old candle that you don't plan on using anymore and turning it into a jar that you can put anything in this is a very a very very simple easy quick um, how to video so I'm just going to go ahead and jump right into it boiling and as you can see it's starting to melt so be careful if you want to touch it but you can move that around okay guys so now that the can the wax in the candle I'll zoom in a little bit so you can see has boiled completely down so there's no more hard wax so what I'm going to do now is you're going to remove do not touch it like this because you'll probably burn yourself remove the candle jar from the heat you're just going to take it and you're going to dump the wax while it's still hot you're going to get all of it out you're going to okay so I'm going to turn off the water now that you have completely uh, gotten as much of the remnants out of the jar that you can, you're just going to come in here and you're going to kind of swish it around with a little bit left. So most of this process is boiling, boiling, boiling. It's your best friend. So now we're going to put some hot water in here and fill it up to about, you don't want it to boil over, to about halfway. What I do is I'm going to put some soap in here, dish soap or any type of soap that you have that's liquid. You're going to want to just put a nice amount in. So now your pot should be, I mean your candle should be back on the stove, boiling with the soap in it so that it'll get all of the griminess out and then, and then you'll just be able to clean out with a towel or a sponge, whatever you like to use. I'll show you guys. Okay, so now we've come to the part that's a little bit more difficult. And what you're going to need to do is just get you a towel after you've washed out your little concoction. You're just going to get your hand in here and you're just going to wipe it clean. I have to make sure that my hand is not completely covering the entire process. So you get in here and you just wash it out just like this. And then your jar is nice and clean. So then you're done. Except now you have this ugly little tag that you might want to get rid of. So I'm going to show you guys how to get rid of that now. Okay, so now we've reached the last and final part. Which is removing this little sticker from the front of your candle. So that you can just have a clean, nice jar that is completely see-through. You need a blow dryer. You're just going to put your blow dryer on high and you're going to hold it not too close to the jar because you don't want the jar to completely heat up or burst or anything like that. And now, you should be able to completely just slide this off now. And okay, and now your sticker is completely off. So you just toss that in your trash. Now if you have a little bit of a residue on your jar, which it might happen sometimes, unfortunately, even with blow dryer trick, you just get your towel again. You just get your towel again, and you just rub it off. It's super easy because the glue was already you know kind of melt it from the blow dryer sometimes if you have really small stickers it's way easier to get the sticky glue off but if you have like the bigger stickers it's much more area to cover so it's a lot harder okay so we have reached the end of this how to DIY video so I the jar is completely done now there's no sticky residue or candle wax residue left on here and now it's the time where you turn this into something Okay guys, now that you have followed my easy steps on how to turn an old candle jar into a jar for, you know, everyday use, 
these are some of the things that you can turn these jars into. If you want to, you can turn it into a supply holder for pens, pencils, paint brushes, paint, or if you have an airtight lid like this candle jar does, you can easily turn it into something to uh, hold your dry goods in your kitchen like cookies and candy and flour and rice and sugar because it has this airtight lid it will keep the food or if you cleaned out a little candle jar like this you can also turn this into something I have a chalkboard in my room so I use this to hold my chalk in so these are easy ways that you can turn these old candle jars into useful things so I hope you guys enjoyed this video Comment, like, subscribe if you wanna, and I also vlog on this channel as well. So if you would, if you're interested in seeing a daily vlogger, please go and check out my vlogs. Thanks, guys. Bye.